What's well, up everyone, we are back with the Suicide of Rachel Foster game, so we're just gonna continue and in the last episode, well the first episode, um, we kind of spent the first sort of day here I think. Okay, so we start off where I started off at the end of the last video. Okay, right, so I chose the same choices as I chose before, um, he just said we'll be forever grateful for baked bones, um, so, um, Let's uh, have a look at our map. I uh, search for food Pickle. in the kitchen. Irving, uh, how long has it been since someone's inspected the pantry? Inspected? You mean stocked? I just like to know if I should choose between malnutrition and food poisoning. There'll be tons of things to eat. Hmm. Oh, definitely no mice or roaches. Pretty sure about that. Um, I'm more concerned about bacterial, uh, a mouse ain't my ideal roommate. Ah, uh, roommate. When I was growing up, I used to love chasing mice. Now they're gonna chase me. Uh, you'll see. There's nothing to worry about. Uh, I had an ant farm. Uh, okay. Friendly. For a while, <laughs> I hid an ant farm in the closet. I think Leonard suggested it. One morning, my bed was swarming with ants. You must have freaked out. My mother did. The ant farm ended up straight in the trash. Your career as an entomologist nipped in the bud. Didn't think I still remembered all these little things. Huh. Okay, right, there is moldy food everywhere. There's some food, but it looks moldy. Weird. I didn't expect that. Uh, there's a freezer. Take a look there. Okay. Freezer. Oh no, surely that can't be the way to the freezer. Freezer, 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 freezer. Um food storage, no chemicals. Okay. There's these. Obviously apparently not freezers. Um Okay. I've no idea where the freezer would be then. It's definitely not oh wait, no, this is freezer. Oh, we're gonna get no. Oh, please leave the door like open. Uh, okay, soup. Uh, what is this? Mug lunch. Oh, nice. Re two minutes microwave full. Okay. <laughs> Do I have? Oh my god, no way. I like the little cutscenes. <sighs> Hey, right. you kidding? Why do I feel like there's something out there? How the hell am I supposed to get out of here? Do I just eat the pork and beef? Okay. That's weird. Don't like that whatsoever. Oh, uh, I almost forgot. There might be a problem with the fridge door. Just make sure it doesn't Are you close. fucking with me? No. Wait, what did I say? It would have been more useful to know that before I got locked in. Oh, holy shit. I'm a freaking space cadet. Yeah, I could have died in there. She sounds a little bit like Ellie from The Last of Us. Um. Okay, so... Uh, the microwave could be useful to heat up the beans. Okay, let's go and see if we can use this microwave. Wherever the hell a microwave would be, this. That's, I didn't have a chance to like read the options to choose what one, so I just like left it on the first option. Um, okay, yeah, no, this is scary. I'd like want to take the microwave to like my room or something. <laughs> Is that a bit weird? Guess we just wait for it. Uh, yeah, I guess we just wait. Okay, so space is actually to zoom in. Um, the depth of field in this is actually pretty good. Albeit maybe like a little bit slightly annoying, it's like, it's pretty good. Okay, um, 
I guess we're just waiting for the beans. Speak about them and they shall be done. Oh yum. Oh yum. At least take it to like the room. There's nothing on that spoon. It's like yoga adverts. Ew. Gross. Yeah, it's like yoga adverts where it's just like, mmm, and the bottom of the spoon is not covered whatsoever. Not realistic, really. Do I put this in the bin, or do I just have to... Uh-huh. Sorry to interrupt your continental breakfast. Uh, I got a hold of Mr. Jenkins, the attorney. Uh, when is he getting here? About time. When's he getting here? He tried to make it. His car ended up in a ditch between York Road and Valley. Oh, come on. He called 911 after just a mile. Uh, gonna cry. I'll finish the inspection. Um, uh, I'll finish it, I well, guess. Well, I might as well finish the inspection. I can do it without Jenkins. Uh, he told me to give you a message. Here it is. He says to... Hmm. This is a swear word and you don't need to hear it. Uh, yeah. Uh, Nicole. At this point, start assessing the general conditions of the hotel on your own. Uh, jot down what you want to keep. I recommend you start with the second floor. It's surely the most damaged. Please, only call me if you've got good news. Okay, so start with the second floor. There's a ballroom through here. I haven't been through, like, this area yet. I feel like I'm just, like, exploring everywhere oh maybe this is where that leads okay do you remember me said uh in the last episode um that's dangerous wait that's like proper scratched up oh that is really scratched up at first i thought it was blood but yeah there's this door here that leads uh down or up i think oh man that's creepy uh fireplace room restroom and then the first floor so apparently that's staff only or was it this room i don't know apparently uh there's like a secret weird room there by the looks of it are these the hotel rooms oh picture um okay that's kind of cool it's like a crack in the do i get a flashlight at all might come in handy okay anyway right we'll leave this i guess we don't uh i guess we don't really want hello oh i'm definite uh out of tune piano okay we're definitely hearing things let's go back up here i guess um oh this is very daunting so what do I have to do? Uh, suggest us to inspect the second floor first. Okie dokie. What is this broken? It's just like a little storage room. Uh, okay, I'm on the first floor. So the second floor is obviously, you know, above this one. <laughs> I'm just so intrigued about like freaking everything. Okay, so this is the room. I have no idea where this is. Where does this even lead? Okay, this obviously isn't the room. That one's bolted. Okay, that's kind of creepy. So this is... I don't know. I still need to actually find the key. Uh, for... Uh, oh, okay. So the master suite's through there. Right, okay. So that's just the other end. Let's go to the second floor then. Yeah, so I still need to find the like master key for all the bedrooms and stuff. So the top floor is apparently the most damaged... So I guess we'll go... Oh god, yeah, that is kind of damaged. Now you're stiff. Oh, I have to radio stuff. Mold. Okay, cool. There's some serious water stains on the second floor. That floor is pretty run down. There's some windows missing and water damage too. Yeah. I literally just said water damage. Okay, so there was a painting hanging up there. Um, okay, so I wonder where, oh, the museum's up here, so I wonder where the key is, like, the master key for all the rooms. This place is cool. I like this. I definitely, like, I'm not sure I would want to, like, be here on my own, though. I wonder what else we have to, 
um, assess the windows maybe. That window seems to be intact, so that's fine. Oh wow, this freaking corridor goes on forever. Uh, oh, okay. From what I can see, I can't rule out serious damage. Uh, refurbishment was scheduled, but they never finished. Thanks. Just like, cut me off there. Okay, there's a still door here. Oh, I don't like the look of that. Here I am. Uh, what's up? The hallway on the second floor is cut off. The door to the west wing is locked. Your father started renovations, but he didn't get the bank loan and had to stop. Leonard's attic is at the end of the hallway. His man cave. Does that mean something to you? I tried so hard to forget about that room for years. Anyway, uh, the west wing is pretty run down after all this time with no windows. Hello? You there? You always have an answer to everything. What do you mean? Uh, you know too much. Tell me the truth. Oh, tell me the truth. Tell me something. What are you hiding from me? I don't understand, Nicole. You know how to turn on the furnace. You know where to find food and that the fridge door is busted. You know my family's story and the hotels. It's up to FEMA to deliver the supplies to isolated places like the Timberline. I've been up there with the truck every month since I've been on duty. Is something wrong? Um, how should I have known? Uh, we'll stay silent. I don't know. I, I don't know what you know and what you don't know. Uh, what difference does it make? None. I... I'm sorry if I upset you. No one can upset me. I better keep doing the inspection. Do I need like a pen and paper? Right, there's a cancellation thing here. Um, I'm guessing it's just like a work cancellation. That is a lot of money. Almost a million? What? What? That's crazy. 80k for general labor? What? That's insane. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay, that's freaking insane. There is a room around here that we can go in, though. Um, I'm just hoping that we can go in, like... Ew. Ew. That's kind of satanic, no? I don't want that stuff in my hotel. <laughs> I don't want that stuff in my hotel. Okay, so we have a room check. Can I zoom in? Um, I don't know what that says. Sink, something, walls, rats, two, enough is enough. Um, okay, guest room cleaning checklist. Okay, I can't remember if we can zoom in on things or not. I don't think we can. That's weird to have like a tile there. No? Anyway, why do I care? We're not like, we're not using this as our own kind of like stay we're just <laughs> we're just uh passing through okay so there's a chain there we obviously can't get past um mate no don't you dare is it rats oh that is weird i mean this is yeah this is just weird i don't like this whatsoever i don't like this i don't know where that noise even come from uh, do I report the mold? Man, that was creepy. Hello? Wait, is something moving down there? Okay, it's just like top or something. Anyway, right. I feel like I'm... I feel like I'm getting kind of like... Out of high end. It's kind of creeping me out. What is this? Staff only. I don't have a... I can't get in that room. Okay, whatever. We can't get in that room. I think what do we will do? Where the hell is that even coming from? Oh, this. This is 
eerie, yeah. so eerie. Hello? Who is this? Uh, I didn't understand. Tell me who you are. Who the hell are you? Rachel is still there. Don't sell the hotel. Is this a joke? Who is this? Don't do anything stupid. Uh, I'll call the sheriff. You're gonna pay for this lame-ass joke. I have a phone, a cell phone. I'm talking with FEMA and I'm gonna get them to call the sheriff. Okay, this is... Okay, so... The Rachel chick is still here? Like, how? Is she just, like, camping out here? Uh, okay, so the museum... The museum's done it. I think that we should just go and check the museum. Um, because my to-do list is actually empty, so... You pissed at me? Uh, I'm not 10 years old. I've got a different problem. I don't have time to rehash my past with you. I've got a different problem. Someone just called the hotel. What? Who? Uh, no idea. A secret admirer. Uh, no idea. It, it was a bad connection. W what did they want? They said, Rachel is alive. Don't sell the hotel. <sighs> Idiot. There's something else that doesn't make sense. The phone lines are down. Leonard stopped paying the bill months ago. I'll ask someone to run a check. Uh, can you do that? Uh, they break my... Uh, can you do that? I didn't know FEMA had FBI authority. Around these parts, time passes in a different way. Some stories seem like they've been forgotten, but actually they just sink down. Sink down? Like tea leaves in a cup. Uh... Okay. I think I get it. Almost. That girl's death. Rachel. It was the result of painful events, and now it's someone's obsession. You talking about anyone in particular? Well, her death ruined two families that everyone looked up to. Yours and Rachel's. Your father, McGrath, the genius astrophysicist. And Rachel's father, the upstanding Reverend Foster, known all over the county. <laughs> Not something easy to forget around here. You know what I think? They can go get fucked. Every one of them. I know what we went through. No one else. Fuck them. Okay, she's so angry, right? So there's this room here. Oh, okay. So it's actually day three now, apparently. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to find my way back there. Why? Oh, that sucks. Hey, cutie pie. Daddy? Uh, Nicole, it's Irving. Oh, <sighs> sorry. I uh, haven't slept uh, like that for ages. Where were sleeping pills in the beans? Must oh. have been sleeping pills well. <laughs> in those beans. Since I've been here, it's like I'm literally hibernating. You had a tough day yesterday. I think I had a dream. About? Uh, my dad, I don't remember. Uh, we'll say my dad. Leonard, maybe. Okay, uh, I need you to pay attention, though. Should I worry? The storm brought down some power lines. There are blackouts all over. Um, okay, the lights are weird. <laughs> Actually, the lights are acting a little weird. <sighs> I was afraid of that. I don't like the idea of you up there on your own in the dark. We gotta do something. My electrical know-how is slightly limited. It's okay. I can guide you to the emergency generator. If we activate it, you'll be self-sufficient. Uh, where's the hitch? Where's the hitch? Too easy. Where's the hitch? Uh, there are two ways of getting to the circuit breaker. Straight through the garage's side door, or from the floor you're on. But? The garage side door is stuck. You'll have to pass through the crawl space along the entire building and climb down from your floor. If the power goes out, you'll be completely in the dark. All right. What do I have to do? Uh, check the closet in your father's apartment and see if he left anything you can use for lighting. Oh, on my way. You know, literally, I'd just leave it till morning. I'd shut the doors and I'd just, like, leave it until morning. Like, it's really not that important right now. 
Um, okay, so to check his closet, unless it just means like closet outside, maybe. Um, okay, it might just mean closet outside. Oh, unless it means this little closet. Nope. Okay, that was too creepy to be real. Uh, okay, closet, closet, closet. Any news? I found a Polaroid. Family photo? Anything important? No, I mean a camera. It looks like it works. You want to take a photo of the generator? Oh, no, you moron. I was thinking of using the flash for lighting. Oh, smart. You can try. Uh, had one just like this. I wonder who this belongs to. Uh, had one just like this. I had one just like this when I was 16. Leonard gave it to me. Maybe it's the same one. No way. I broke mine hiking on Hogback Mountain. I cried all day with Leonard insisting it was only an instrument used to capture images. He said, you keep the really important ones inside. Can't say he was wrong. Oh, yep. Anyway, the Polaroid's better than nothing. The light from the flash could come in handy. I don't like this whatsoever. Where do I even have to go? Uh, so that I must enter the crawl space in the first floor staff area. Um, okay. First floor staff? Mate, are you hearing laughter? Or is it literally just me? That's horrifying. Oh, I can. Okay, staff. Is this it? Oh my god, no. <laughs> uh, staff area, staff area, staff area. Uh, first floor, first floor, first floor. Okay, so it's obviously not around here. This is too eerie for me, too eerie. I feel like I'm going to do that and at some point there's just going to be someone like literally right there in front of me. Yeah, like that. You heard that? You heard that door slam? That's not normal. It's not normal. I wouldn't. I'd just hide in the freaking room. Okay, nice little wall. M a murder hey. eyes. Nice. Okay, almost there. I think the lights are getting worse. You need to move fast. On the same floor of your apartment, in the staff area, there's a small storeroom. Your father asked us several times to fix the lock. Fingers crossed, it's still broken. That's where the access to the crawl space is. Uh, what a professional what tone. What a professional tone. Yeah, I use it when I want to make a good impression. <laughs> You're the only human being I can interact with while I'm hostage here. Whatever you say will impress me. What happens when I get to the closet? You'll have to go down to the breaker box and switch it on. Alright. Doesn't sound like rocket science. Uh, hurry up, please. You suck at reassuring people. Okay, wait. What am I doing? Am I supposed to be going through here? No, because that's for the museum, right? Oh, okay, through here. I knew that this was going to be something. Crawl space door. Um, okay, like a little wind-up torch. Oh, it's like a little dynamo. Okay. Um, okay, cleaner, I guess we'll, we'll just put this back. Uh, well, I, I don't really want to do this, but... I found it. the crawl space, and also a dynamo flashlight. Know how to use it? I think I just have to push the lever continuously. Is everything okay? Uh, claustrophobia... Um, okay. When I was a kid, I used to crawl through tunnels like a mouse, but the crawl space seems so narrow now. Maybe you gained weight. <laughs> it's called growing up, idiot. <laughs> okay, there's like this little note here. Uh, I left you the dynamo flashlight. You'll have to work a little to make some light. Haha, -ha, Ben. Oh god. I don't like this. Like, using this to crawl through, like, the whole hotel? Are you 
Ugh, no. Okay, you know what I said about in like episode one about having like a hotel would be kind of cool? Yeah? I, um, I take it back. Shit! What's wrong? Uh, you're a clever one. Uh, I'm in the dark. I am totally in the dark. I'd appreciate some help. Uh, okay, stay calm. Uh, can you see the bundle of cables above your head? Uh, anyway, there should be some cables along the- uh, Yeah, I know what a bundle is. Okay, okay, easy does it. All you need to do is follow them and you'll get to the generator room. Don't go any other way, otherwise who knows where you'll end up. Perfect. I got the flashlight, sorta. I got my breadcrumb trail, more like my cable trail, whatever. I can do it. All right, yep, yeah. easy does it. That honestly scared the absolute crap out of me, like on the inside. <laughs> I just saw an arm and I was like, oh hell no. Okay, so bundle of cables, bundle of cables, oh my goodness. This is, it's very eerie. I know it's like a whole like kind of story vibe, kind of walking sim, this, that and the other, but it's very, very, very fucking eerie. Especially with headphones, I definitely keep hearing noises and I'm not a fan, I'm not a fan of them. Okay, we shut the grate in, great. Ha, huh, great. Uh, right, I guess that we done it? Do I have to leave through the same way? Or do I have to push more buttons? Oh wait, what is this? Do I have to pick anything up? Oh, a lipstick. Um, okay. Oh, I picked it up. Why? <laughs> no, what's up? Uh, hi. I, I want to ask you something. Okay. Uh, go ahead. How long has the hotel been closed? Uh, about four years. Uh, yeah, from 89. I mean, did anyone think about doing a thorough clean of the basement? Don't know. Uh, probably pretty rushed. Why? I found something. Another Polaroid? A lipstick. Huh. Um, a lipstick here, can you explain that? Doesn't that seem weird? It's... a lipstick? You don't get it. It looks really old. I remember this brand. The, the girls at school used it. Weird. What? It didn't dry out. I could even use it now. It's perfect. I'm afraid I don't get it. Irving, this brand doesn't exist anymore. It's been... I don't know, nine or ten years. Strange someone should wait ten years to open a lipstick just to use it, don't you think? Why are you telling me this, Nicole? You want to get pretty there with the generator? <laughs> don't be silly, uh, it gives me the creeps. Are you crazy? Nicole, it's just another one of those things customers forget. Uh, I... well... yeah. You're probably right. Oh wow, okay. Do I have to pick this screwdriver up or anything? Oh my god, okay. We're on day four. We're on day four. Okay, so we are on day four now. Um, quickly before this like loads up as well, I will uh, click pause. I'm going to leave this second video here. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying it. Um, it's definitely, definitely giving me the creeps. Uh, and yeah, so we're on day four now. So thank you all so, so much for watching. Hit the like button, leave comments down below. Do not forget to subscribe if you are new. And I will see you all in the next video. Take care. Bye.